So you guys, I'm gonna go over the Excel list totaling for my recording. It'll just take three minutes, so in case you're wondering what's going on. All right, so if you want to calculate how much your item is gonna cost with the tax, you first need to put the unit price and how many of that item that you're going to need. Um, you need to calculate what the tax is in the city where your store is located. And then when you put it into the, so say if I'm doing 8%, I put in 8 and then I put in the percent sign and Excel automatically makes it into the decimal form. Okay, so here's here's the magic part. Up here at the formula bar, you put an equal sign. Then you click on your unit price. You put a multiplication sign. And you multiply that by the amount that you need. So this is going to be $4.26 times the three items that you're going to purchase. And then you're going to multiply that by what the tax is. So the great thing about that is it gives you that your tax is going to be a dollar two. It doesn't tell you the total cost. So to get the total cost, you're going to need to add back in the unit price times the amount needed. Once you do that, you get $13.80 total. So if you want that to apply to all of the items that you select for your table, you just grab this little bottom right hand corner and drag it and it will apply that same operation to each of the lines and get calculate the total cost. And that's how you use Excel to calculate the cost.